So after I cheated on my husband, I gave him a hall pass. But here's the reason why I did that is because I didn't want to take the responsibility of getting rid of all demons that I opened up my marriage to. And usually this is what people do when they cheat. They want their of their spouse to cheat on them back so it would give them a reason to feel better in some way. But let me tell you, that's the wrong way to do it. It's the wrong way to go about it because at the end of the day, you make matters worse. And even though I knew that that option was put forth in front of me, I knew that wasn't the right choice. Yeah. That's not the way that we try to rebuild a marriage. If you want to stay in a marriage that's still on a downfall mm -hmm. and just ride it out downhill, that's up to you if you want to make that choice. But I was not about to make that same choice if I know I also have another option of getting back in the face of God, praying for my marriage, praying for my wife, and trying to do the things and correct the wrongs that we had that led us into that position. Shut the fuck up. Both of y'all motherfuckers. I, what the fuck? What the hell? My boy, you do not stay no business. You was, you a sucker. She cheated on you and you gonna stay with her? The only way you gonna do that, I see you doing that, is if you was already cheating. Ain't no fucking way. Ain't no fucking way no bitch about to cheat on me and I'm just gonna, just gonna sit there and take it. It ain't gonna happen. I don't know what the fuck you got going on, boy, but it ain't gonna happen over here. Listen. I'm... What the hell? Listen, listen. This is why people should not get married. I don't I don't understand marriage in, in this time now. You know what I'm saying? Cause it's all this it's it's it is it, it, it don't make no sense no more. Okay? The the shit not I thought marriage was supposed to be sacred, it's supposed to be serious. This shit is a joke nowadays. You feel me? So she was gonna give you a hard pass cause she cheated. My boy, you should have just divorced her. Get rid of her. Get her the fuck out of here. This bitch had another dick in her mouth. You know what I'm saying? On your time, though. You know what I'm saying? But you with her. Another dick in her fucking mouth, my nigga. I'm just assuming. You know what I'm saying? Listen, because if a, if a shorty gonna cheat with another dude, that means she really like him, bro. That means she really liked him. That means your marriage is over. I don't care if you would've went to go fuck another bitch, my nigga. Listen, that shit staying in your marriage, that shit gonna sit there. You feel me? Every time y'all get into an argument, you gonna bring this up to her about her cheating. Like, I, I, I don't. The marriage is a fucking joke. I'm not letting nobody cheat on me and I'm gonna stay with them. You get one time, you cheat, it's over. It's so simple. It's so fucking simple. We not about to do this tit for tat shit and all that. And then that's when you get diseases and shit. You gonna catch something. Keep playing around if y'all want to. Y'all talk about hey, all that, all that preaching at the end. I don't give a fuck about none of that shit, nigga.